Hey guys, on this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to customize a lot of things that you have on your iPhone. So whether you have an iPhone 6 or 6 Plus, iPhone 5S, 5C, 5, 4S, this is the way to do it, okay? Um, even 5, iPhone 4 and 3GS. So this is a 3G right here, okay? This is antique. Um, you can customize it just the same way that you can customize these other phones. So basically on your phone, okay, we're going to go into settings, first of all. And I'm just going to show you the basics where your wallpaper is and all that. So here's your wallpaper display brightness and all that. Um, if you go into wallpaper, that's where you can change your wallpaper. You can put a picture as your background. You can choose pretty much anything as your background for your screen, um, your lock screen or your just your background screen. Okay, so you can set it up all from here. I just want to get that out of the way really fast and then going to moving your apps around. A lot of people want to move their apps around everywhere and delete some of them and maybe reinstall some other ones. So we're just going to move them around. To move them around, all we have to do is hold our finger on top of one of them and they're going to start shaking like that as you can see on the screen. Okay, so once it starts shaking, you're going to see that those X's. Okay, once you see those X's right there, that means if you tap on one of the X's, you will delete the app, okay? So it's right on the left corner, top corner. If you tap on the X of any of these apps, okay, you can just scroll, um, you will delete it. So I'm gonna delete one for now, so, so you, you guys can just see exactly how that happens. I'm just choosing which one. Okay, I'm gonna choose this one. So I'm gonna delete the green one on the bottom left si hand side, okay? So I'm just gonna tap on the X. It's gonna tell me this. Would you like to delete it? And yes, I would. Okay, and that's it. Well, once you delete it, doesn't mean that you can't get it back. Let's say you paid for that app. It's still on your App Store history, okay? So you can go into your App Store and re-download it. And you, have to, you don't have to pay for it again, okay? Just in case. That means you just deleted it from your iPhone. You're not really deleting it from your App Store history. There's a way to kind of delete from your App Store history. I have a separate video for that, which I can show you. But right now, it's just the basics, okay? Now, before we get out from this shakiness, just in case, if you want to get out from the shakiness right away, just press the home button. So that's this middle button right here. Just tap it and you get rid of that. So I'm going to shake it up again, actually. Okay. So if we have them shaked up again, all we have to do is hold our finger on top of one and move it around. So that's how you move them around. So you can move any one of them that you want, one side to the other. Okay, just by holding your finger on one and moving it around. <clears throat> Same thing if you want to move it to another screen. So if I want to move it to the screen, I can just drop it here. And that's it. If I don't want it there anymore, I can just go back to the screen where it was. And just leave it there. Or another screen. Now if you want to make a folder, all you have to do is actually drop this app or any app on top of another app, such as this one. It's going to open up like that. I'm going to let it go and it created another folder. Now on top where you see education, you can put any name that you want. You can just press on the X or just tap where it says education. Um, and we're just going to type up whatever you want, uh, office. So let's say these are all um, apps that have to do with your office or anything to do with that, for example. Then just tap on done. Once you tapped on done, all you have to do is just tap anywhere and there's your folder. Okay, I'm just going to tap on the home button. Okay, so now everything's steady, it's kind of normal. Okay, and there's my folder. Now let's say I want to get rid of my folder now. Now this is how you open it and you, and you close it, just tap anywhere, just in case. Um, but let's say you want to get rid of this folder you made by accident. Uh, people, when they move them around, they make folders by accident all the time. So how to get rid of them, just hold your finger on top of one of them, drag it out, just leave it there. Go out again, take your other app, take it out of the folder, put it there, your folder disappears. So that's how you get rid of the folders that you may have made by accident. Those are the basics to customize your iPhone and just move things around. If you guys want to find out more stuff and customize even further your iPhone, um, make your personalized ringtones with your own music, not something you have to pay for, there's a separate video for that as well. I also have um, iPhone tutorials on the whole manual where you can see 30 minutes of everything that you can do on your iPhone, but that's separate, okay? I'm trying to make this quick and short so you guys don't get bored, okay? So that's it for this video. If you guys have any questions, comments, you can write them here below, and don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.